thanks for putting this together. You don't strike me as the kind to initiate this kind of thing. But, uh, where's everyone else? We normally get the whole crew together, you know? Tails, Knuckles, Amy. Even Dr. Eggman usually crashes the party. You sure he's not hiding around here somewhere? They would just get in the way. This is a battle between you and me. Besides, it's Sonic X Shadow Generations, not Sonic X Shadow, X Tails, X Amy, X Knuckles. Okay, X we get it. Well, if that's the way you want to play, then may the best hedgehog win. At Sonic underscore Paradox asks Shadow, if you had to save only Tails or Sonic from danger, who would you choose and why? I... I know you too well, Shadow. I can see this coming a mile away. I'd save Tails, because Sonic's always getting himself into trouble, and I don't want to deal with his nonsense today. <clears throat> Did I get that right? That's what you sound like. Is that your answer? I'd save you, Sonic. Deal with it. What? No, wait, you'd, you'd really save me? Tails can fly, you idiot. If you're both hanging off a cliff, he can just get up. Oh... You're always running headfirst into danger, so you probably need the help, too. And there it is. Plus, I'm faster than you anyway. All right, all right, enough of the sentimental stuff. This question's closed. Cupid the Fifth asks, Shadow, can you, as the ultimate life form, do one of the things that Sonic can't, swim? Wow, they really sent in a whole letter with this one, too. That's a quick and easy way to show up Sonic in a test of skill. Wait, why are you on his side? Don't give him any ideas. Yes. Actually, I can swim. As quick and easy as it would be to show him up in a swimming competition, it wouldn't be satisfying. Oh, and why is that? Afraid I might surprise you? Because you'd be dead in 30 seconds. I need to see the look on your face when I defeat you. Drowning just isn't enough. Oh, well, fine. Then why don't we have a plummeting to Earth contest next and see who survives that one? Are you gonna need floaties for that one, too? They're not floaties! They're a fashion toy! Let's move on. Zerlzak Dur asks, Why do you have chest fur and Sonic doesn't? Is it because Sonic is less manly than you are? Oh, come on. They did not add that last part. On my honor. Yes, Zerlzak. I am more of a man than Sonic will ever be. Okay, first off, we're hedgehogs, and I just like to keep it clean cut. Makes me way more aerodynamic so I can keep running laps around you. It's not even just the chest fur. Even just hearing your voice. I didn't know voices could naturally be an octave that high. What did you just say about my voice? How did you do that? It is called acting, my friend. Is that supposed to be Ezio? It's totally Ezio! Lame. Bubblewrap G5 asks, Shadow, why does Black Doom keep sending you to Radical Highway? Black Doom wanted to torment me. He knows the significance of those memories and opened up those wounds to hurt me. Unfortunately for him, I am stronger than that. You sure he didn't think it was just... Radical? Leave it to you to downplay my vulnerability, Mr. Green Hill Zone. You're right, you're right. I, I'm sorry. But I mean, it is pretty radical. The Lowest Five asks, Can you wish me luck on my final test tomorrow? Wait, let me see if I understand this right. This person has an exam tomorrow, and they're spending their time listening to us instead of studying for a test that may determine their educational future? Well, uh, yeah, I guess that's what it sounds like. Sounds like poor time management to me. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Wow, lighten up. Well, good luck, the lowest five.